Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end. This is Buckingham Palace. On our channel, we show how all the world is mapped out in this fashion, going all the way back to the archangels, the good and the bad, and that the whole earth is going along as they plan. But this beast right here, this bear, is in the Bible, and right here at Buckingham Palace, you can see what looks like Prince William. And you can see how there's a link all the way up to a five-pointed star that something can come down through the bear and onto the earth. This is in the biblical scriptures that this is the satanic beast that will fight Jesus. It does not mean that this one country will. This is a world system. This is also shown in the United States of America as well as with China, Russia, Saudi Arabia, and many other places around the world. All of these different kings and princes. See the prince? See a king that is not a king yet? Prince William. Well, in the USA, the Temple of Baal, or Bell. See the Bell? Baal? The devil. It, it, they actually take this one exhibit around several places. But now it's going to be coming towards to the USA. Coming to Washington, D.C., September 26. That is considered to be Satan's temple, Baal. Or if you hear somebody talking about like ringing the bell, that they are ringing the bell, that means the bell. See here? When somebody goes like that, goes, hey, we're ringing the bell for you to come in, a lot of times that actually means for Baal's temple. Well, there was another show on recently that just came out called Salvation, where the world leaders are all afraid of this asteroid coming to destroy the pyramid. See how it's right over the top of the pyramid right there? And to destroy the world system that's going on now. The dragon. the beast out of the sea, having seven heads and ten horns. These ten horns are kings that are not kings yet, like a prince. And they're all going to fight Jesus' second coming. You have the woman on the beast. And the ten horns with us are ten kings, which have received no kingdom as yet, but receive power as kings. One hour with the beast. These have one mind. They are all one. The different presidents, the different world rulers, something's controlling all of them, in a small way. It doesn't have to control their whole mind. It can just be the whisper in their head. These shall make war with the Lamb, and the Lamb shall overcome them, for his Lord of Lords and King of Kings they that are with him are called and chosen and faithful. So you can see this beast, the beast out of the sea, has the feet of a bear that represents them upon the earth. Mapped out right here. Perfectly. And you see the spirits coming down from the stars. And you can actually see Prince William right in there. Just make his face out right there. And there's a dragon right there. And the dragon gave him his power. So right there. Has a lot to do with this V, like your Darth Vader controlling things. Well, it's also over in the USA. But that is part of this pyramid. <clears throat> Just as on the USA dollar bill you have the pyramid. 
and is has anybody noticed that um President Trump's saying make America great again make America great Britain again catching the links between there and it also goes all the way to China just like with Mr. Trump wanting a wall and the Great Wall of China the dragon they're all coming together Obama also represented one of these kings it doesn't mean he has to come back into power he's had his time and the ten horns with thou sawest are ten kings which have received no kingdom as yet but received power as kings one hour with the beast Obama had his time he's had his hour now Mr. Trump is having his time that's the way these systems go just as George Bush just as with the princes and the President Vladimir Putin just as with the Pope see how they're all getting their time all of these different horns well in this show here salvation they say that this asteroid is coming called Samson. In the end, it actually shows up and it's just a giant light in the sky, just like Jesus' second coming. There's a lot of references to Samson being as Jesus. See how it's coming to smash the pyramid? This represents the pyramid. Also, even over here in Britain. See, that's part of the pyramid. Just as with the pyramid on the dollar bill. It's what's called the burdens of Egypt and a curse upon the earth. Well, Samson tore down the temple of Baal, Dagon. And now we have the bell ball coming to, see how it's like a, like a party? The bell ball. That's coming to Washington on the 26th. So there will be symbolism surrounding this in some ways. There. The altar of Satan and child sacrifice. The bell ball. Well, in 1965, there was what's called the Kecksburg UFO here, that fell in the USA. Seen like this bell. This Kecksburg UFO, like ringing the bell. The ball. It fell on December 9th, 1965. Immediately, the next year, in July 14, 1966, Hercules, another symbolism of Jesus, this voodoo began. The Hercules plant was exploded and blew up. There's a big thing about the 50. It's like the 50 stars, 50 states. And just as in the Bible, the fifth trumpet with the beast from the pit rising trying to fight the son of God see how Hercules was already under attack now at that point by 1966 from 1965 when this fell well it fell on December 9th Revelation 12 9 and the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. He was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. In 1965. So it looks like a bell. They made a lot of comparisons to it. with the, Something to do with Hitler's supposed UFO bell. in the USA and then the USA government collected this thing whatever it is like a bell but you see how this symbolism plays out and now we have the bell ball coming to Washington DC well, we don't know if anything's going to happen or anything it was just more symbolism but it's all more signs of Jesus Christ coming because this thing here comes to smash the temple of Baal See Samson? Samson tears down the temple of Baal and Dagon and the dragon and the pyramid and all of these systems and everything. The judge. 
a lot of symbolism of Jesus being on the cross. See him right there? The whole world's like this. It's just that way. Look at this right here in Britain. It's the same thing all around the world. That's what it talks of. This was even shown at the... Um, you can actually see the beast out of the sea where the school shooting happened in the USA recently. At the Stone Man Douglas High School shooting, which we showed in our last few videos, the Stone Man representing Jesus. They're attacking him in voodoo fashion. In the USA, there was this shooting at this school where 17 people were killed by this one person who said he was actually demonically possessed, hearing voices in his head. As we've shown, they're all one mind. It, this thing just goes right in the head, almost like a telephone call. They're going after the stone man. See how in voodoo fashioned, the demon attacked the stone man Douglas and the children. Bell, ball, the, of child sacrifice. Altar of Satan and child sacrifice. That's what the world leaders are all doing. They all This thing just terrorizes. See how they're giving the children to them? The stone man represents Jesus, just as here. In this show, they called and said that this was Samson coming. The son. The second coming of Jesus. This is one of the things that's fighting him. This Kecksburg bell that fell on the day of Satan's fall. Immediately after that, the voodoo began in 1966 of the attacks on anything to do with Jesus. See, going after the Hercules plant. That's that beast. Well, over here where the school shooting was, we can see this. See the school? And now we can see the pyramid. You can see the pyramid and the shark attacking the school. Right there. So you can see how all these world leaders, see all the kids were sacrificed. The world leaders know this is going on. And now you can see the bear is here also. Don't think it's just one country against us. It's our own presidents. We showed that, that Obama was involved in this stuff also. That's how they get their power. That's how they get their hour and their presidencies. Satan can get through our election process. He's running most everything. He told Jesus that he was running all the kingdoms of the earth. So there it is right there. And it's the same thing over in China. Especially in China and over in Russia. So just know it's all right in front of us. And here comes the, the temple of the bell ball. And there's the stone coming, Jesus, just as Samson. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Of the 30,000 people who work in the Pentagon, fewer than 40 have clearance. I'm sure you understand why this needs to remain classified. NASA discovered an asteroid. Samson. Samson has the potential to collide with Earth in 186 days. Asteroid, Earth, boom. I'm sorry. I can't make the world safe for you. I'm onto something that someone somewhere doesn't want public. I'm telling you, the sky is falling. Yeah.